I have a really good course called Vision in Your Child. It's really understanding the foundations of the vision. And any of you, if I mention with the vision and you haven't been with an ophthalmologist, please, because I just have a munchkin here now. Five and a half on this eye, three and a half. So what does that mean? This eye sees to about here, and the other eye can see to about here. The eyes are not going to ever match up. So what he has to do is, he, if he wants to see far, he literally patches this eyes with his nose so he can see far. And that's where some people go, oh, my child doesn't have head control. This is where I was talking about in the beginning, when you don't know how to evaluate a video properly. You just sit there and want to do this, where really he's, he's doing this to focus, versus because he can't use both eyes. But the eyes are not working together. What you're seeing, again, is directionality, and I know I'm sure that ophthalmologists said the eyes are fine. I'd like to see the script, because what it is when, when the eyes are not working together, really what's going on, you have directionality, right? But especially going through the left, the left eye wants to come in, and then it goes off. And so you want to bring that together, and then you want to add the vision with the spine. I have a really good course on head and vision, and I would start with that first because I think you really need to strengthen the visual qualities. That's where you, I would say more delayed visual maturation, A, because of the age, and just uh, the, the, it's more sporadic vision than following. You're looking, see how my left eye comes over? See how my right eye comes over? What you're getting more at is more, see how my, my left eye is doing it or my right eye is doing it. But my left eye is not coming over. So the difference, this is typical vision. I counter with my pelvis and then where it's the right and the left. You see that too, Megan, right? That kind of movement. And, and you all can do it. Look at something normally, left, right. Really swing those hips so you can feel it because this is what a baby would be doing versus, and just drop that eye back and, and then try and catch what you were looking at. So you notice that there's a fall and then you have to see. This, I never lose the sight. And that's what you want to strengthen. And patching is probably the best way to do it and the patching program would be the best way.